From the men and women who served to protect us uh, tonight, 10 soldiers from the Nebraska Army National Guard, they came home after serving in Afghanistan, and our Chase Moffat was there. A warm welcome home for Luke Holland with the Nebraska Army National Guard, coming home after a six-month deployment in the Middle East. I had a great group of guys, uh, and they made it very easy for me uh, to, you know, to be a good leader. The soldiers are part of a larger unit charged with Airborne Army Special Operations within Central Command. But there was a secret mission underway for Nathan Magruder involving diamonds and his girlfriend, a marriage proposal. Me and her dad and her mom have been planned for, I don't know, four or five months since Christmas about, so it's been a little hard keeping it a secret from her. As for the ring, it sounds like he picked a good one. It's beautiful. It's perfect. It's amazing. You did so good. Yeah, you picked it out once. I did. Yeah. A soldier and a gentleman asking for permission first. Did he ask for your blessing or how did that? He did. He called us on FaceTime around Christmas time and and uh, asked us. And inside the official welcome home ceremony, the soldiers heard from the governor as they transitioned back to civilian life, reconnecting with family. I always want to remind everybody that, you know, they deserve all the credit. My wife always gets the uh, MVP award whenever we come back from one of these. Uh, it's a lot tougher for them. We're live here tonight at City Hall. Sergeant Austin making a quick turnaround. In fact, he'll go back to work Wednesday here for the city of Omaha, John. Well, uh, Nathan uh, was really paying attention because he noticed that she picked that ring out one time before. <laughs> yeah, exactly, yeah. A good eye definitely pays attention to what she likes. Yeah, well, great story, and uh, thank you for all your service to the uh, men and women. Well, trash pick